Hello everyone, this is Saurav from Pharmacharya. In this video, I will be describing about a brief concepts of Ayurveda, its different branches of treatment, what are the different methods of treatment in Ayurvedic system of medicine for various kinds of associated ailments. Let's get into the video. Ayurveda Ayurveda is the traditional Hindu system of medicine incorporated in Atharva Veda. The term Ayurveda means knowledge of life and longevity has been derived from two words. One is Ayur and another one is Veda. Ayur meaning life and Veda means the science or knowledge of. It is one of the ancient science practice in India and all over the world as an alternate system of medicine. In Shushrut Samhita, Shushrut mentioned that Dhanvantari, Hindu god of Ayurveda, taught medicine to various sages and physicians. Shushruta was one of them. Eight components of the Ayurvedic system of medicines or eight branches of the Ayurvedic system of medicine. Ayurvedic system of medicine has eight different branches for treatment of various kinds of ailments associated with human beings. These eight different branches of treatment of various kinds of ailments are known as Chikitsayam Astangayam. These includes Kaya Chikitsa which deals with the general medicine or medicine for the body. Komar Bhartya this involves the discussion about the parental and the postnatal care of the baby and the mother, different methods of conception and different methods or different treatments of the diseases associated with childhood. Shalya Tantra This deals with the surgical treatment of various kinds of associated diseases and extraction of foreign materials from the body. Next is Shalakya Tantra. This involves the treatment of the disease associated with the open body cavity in the upper body part. This also deals with the diseases associated with eye, ear, nose, tongue and mouth. Next is Bhutavidya. This involves pacification of possessing spirits and the treatment of persons affected by such kind of possessions. Next is Agadha Tantra or Vishagra Virodha Tantra or Toxicology. It deals with the various toxic substances associated with vegetables, animals and minerals. The keys for identifying all these toxic substances present and the different methods for the treatment that is antidote for the toxic substances. The next branch is Rasayan Tantra. It includes rejuvenation and tonics for increasing the lifespan, strength as well as intellect of the individuals. The final and the eighth branch of Ayurvedic system of medicine is Vazikaran Tantra. It involves treatment for increasing the volume of semen sexual pleasure, infertility problems and spiritual development in an individual. Now let us discuss about the different principles of treatment in Ayurvedic system of medicine. According to Ayurveda, human body is consist of tissues that is dhatus, waste materials that is malas and biomaterials that is doshas. There are seven dhatus respectively Ras, Rakt, Mams, Meda, Majja, Asthi and Shukra. All the biomaterials out of which our body is made up of are the five basic elements and these five basic elements are known as Panch Mahabhutas. The Panch Mahabhutas include Earth, Air, Water, Fire and Ether. There are three elemental bodily humors known as doshas or three doshas. This includes vat, pit and kaf. Vat 
composed of air and ether is equated with the nervous system of our body. Vat or Vayu is responsible for all the different kinds of movements and sensations including motor activities inside the body. Pit composed of fire and water and is equated with the enzymes present in our body. Pitt is responsible for all the physicochemical activities that are taking place in our body in the form of metabolism. Pitt is also responsible for the generation of heat and energy in our body. Cuff composed of water and earth and is equated with the mucus. It is the substance which provide compactness to our body by providing the fluid matrix to it. Each dosas has particular attributes within the body and the mind. And the natural predominance of one or more doshas define the physical constitutions that is prakriti and personality of the individuals. A complete harmony or balance in all these three doshas leads to the healthy life or even a slight imbalances in these three doshas leads to the disease condition in an individual. Diagnosis of disease in Ayurvedic system of medicine. Ayurveda has eight different ways to diagnose any illness. It includes Nadi, Mutra, Mal, Jihva, Shabd, Sparsh, Druk and Akruti. In Ayurvedic system of medicine, diagnosis is performed by using the five senses. As for example, hearing is used to diagnose the conditions of breathing and speech. At the end, if we sum up, Ayurveda is the science of knowledge of life and longevity. There are eight different ways of treatment of diseases or there are eight different branches of treatment of diseases in Ayurveda which includes Kaya Chikitsa, Komar Bhartya, Shalya Tantra, Shalakya Tantra, Bhut Vidya, Agad Tantra, Rashayana Tantra and Vazikaran Tantra. According to Ayurveda, human body is composed of three basic things, tissues that is dhatus, waste materials that is mal and biomaterial that is doshas. A diseased condition in the human body results due to imbalance in the any of the three doshas present in the human body that is vata, pitta and kaf. Ayurvedic system of medicine has eight different ways to diagnose various kinds of ailments associated with the human body which includes five basic senses to diagnose the diseases. Let's end this video with this discussion. Hello, I am Saurav from Pharmacharya. If you are new at this channel, then you can contribute my work by pressing the like, share and subscribe button. Thank you for watching.